वेलकम टू माई YouTube चैनल सिविल इंजीनियरिंग क्रिएशन टूडेज क्वेश्चन इज हाउ टू एस्टिमेट द क्वान्टिटी ऑफ ब्रिक्स एंड मोटर यूज इन द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ वॉल हेर यू कैन सी अ वॉल विद डेंशन फिफ्टीन फीट लेंथ टेन फीट हाइट एंड नाइन इंच थिकनेस विद अ डोर एंड अ विंडो दीज आर दजम्पन दैट वी विल कंसिडर फॉर आवर कैलकुलेशन रेशो ऑफ मोटर that is 1 ratio 6 it means one part of cement and six part of sand and the thickness of mortar would be 10 mm which is 0.4 inches and brick dimensions would be 9 into 4.5 into 3 without mortar and with mortar it would becomes 9.4 into 4.9 into 3.4 as we have considered 0.4 inches of thickness of mortar their volume calculated by multiplying these three for calculations these are the steps that we will perform for our calculation first of all we will calculate the volume of wall then number of bricks then mortar and at the end we will calculate the quantity of cement and sand required for the construction of wall so for volume we have to multiply it the length into height into thickness of wall it becomes 112.5 feet cube now we have to reduce the volume of door and window for that we will add these two volumes for door it becomes 15.75 feet cube and for window it is 12 feet cube we have to add them and then subtract it from the total volume of wall so the volume of wall would becomes 84.75 feet cube this is the volume where the bricks and mortar would be lay now we will calculate the number of bricks for that we will use the formula the volume of wall and the brick volume with mortar the volume of wall is 84.75 as you can see we have calculated it here and we will divide it with the brick volume with mortar so the total number of bricks would becomes 936 now we will calculate the mortar for that we have to calculate bricks volume without mortar first bricks volume without mortar would be equals to a single brick volume without mortar multiply it with the total number of bricks that we will used so it becomes 65.8125 feet cube this is the volume where this is the volume of total number of bricks used in the construction of wall now we can calculate the wet volume of mortar by just subtracting it the volume of bricks from the total volume of wall so the wet volume of mortar would becomes 18.93 feet cubes and in si system it is 0.5 meter cube we can convert it into si system by just dividing it with the factor 3.281 cube for dry volume of mortar we have to multiply the wet volume with the factor 1.33 because whenever we went to market for purchasing of material the material is in dry state so the dry volume would be 0.7 meter cube now we can calculate the quantity of cement and sand used with the help of this general formula material ratio divided by it with the sum of ratio into the dry volume for cement one part of cement divided by it with the sum of ratio into the dry volume of mortar it becomes 3.6 feet cubes we can calculate the mass of cement by just using the simple formula density is equals to mass per unit volume mass becomes volume multiplied with the density of material for cement the density is 1440 kg per meter cube one cement bag have 50 kg of cement so we can divide this mass by 50 kg for calculation of number of bags of cement 
for sand similarly six part of sand divided by it with the sum of ratio into the dry volume so 21.6 feet cube of sand required for the construction of wall these are our results wall dimension 15 feet into 10 feet into 9 inches thickness door dimension 7 feet height and 3 feet wide window dimension 4 feet by 4 feet mortar ratio considered 1 ratio 6 and bricks dimension are 9 inch into 4.5 inch into 3 inch thickness so the material required for this 936 number of bricks 3 bags of cement and 21.6 feet cube of sand required for the construction of wall so this is our today's lecture thanks for watching